Hi, this is Vinay from the Competency Tech, and right now we'll see the dynamic IDs creation for HTML elements, which we created by HTML helper. So this is the HTML helper, and for example, 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 I have taken Xbox. When we create Xbox dynamically, uh, n number of Xbox, Xbox dynamically that time how we can give the uh, dynamic IDs so I have taken example like here at the red HTML dot text box here we will give the name of the text here we will give the value of text and after that we will give the attribute in attribute only we will decide the ID so first uh, one by one we will go so let me open uh, the page and here I will give div and under that I will give at the rate HTML dot text box here I will give name my text then I will give the value my value Then I will give, or I don't have, if I don't have any value, so what I will do, I will give empty. Then I will give here, uh, here we can give the ID. Uh, ID how you will give, a uh, new, new, uh, at the rate, ID. To I can give, give like that text. For example, this is one, it will create only one text box right now. But for example, if I create a n number of text box as, as for, uh, e, for each row, so what how I will give? I will give one for loop int i equal to 1 i less than equal to for example 20 i plus ok and here I will close it so let me run this and see how it works It is moving right now. Let's see. So the 20 text boxes is getting created here. Let's see what is the ID for this right now. So we can see the ID is my text, name is my text, and this. So now let's give the dynamic ID. So we can use this variable and just we can add here plus i and save it now we can refresh it see here my text one if i click here see my text two then my text 3 like that we, we can see my text 20 so this is how dynamic uh, id we can create for the dynamically created text boxes so for example if you have n number of row in any grid or using any div and that time if you think that how we can give the separate IDs to each text box that time we can create ID like this this we create when this kind of dynamic ID we create 
when we, we are using the HTML helper. So hope it will help you when you are creating this kind of scenario. And if you have not subscribed my channel, we competency tech. So just subscribe it so that you will get the all uh, tutorial videos and it will help you. Thank you.